that? It's a bunch of leafy greens in a bowl. It's a salad, you cow. <laughs> oh, shit. Whoa, bugs shots right across the bow. Hello, everybody. Grace Joe Blazer, we're back with more kindergarten. The game where show and tell ends one of two ways. Either the teacher is totally unimpressed by whatever you bring, or she sends you to the principal's office, where you promptly get shot in the chicklets. So, I was reading the comments, as I often do. Frontal lobe. That's what the front of the brain is. The frontal lobe. How could I forget? I know how. I'll tell you boys right now. A little Easter egg again. A little glimpse into the life of Gray. So right now, it is 1.15 a.m. I'm recording kindergarten, so I can be up at 6 a.m. to go to work. This is a standard day for me, boys. Welcome to YouTube life, when you are old and beat up. Oh, the days when I could have been 16 years old doing YouTube. Although YouTube wouldn't be around for another, like, two decades or something like that. But, if I could have done it, I totally would have. So if you guys want to do YouTube, follow your dreams now, before you're older, and you have a job, and a wife, and a family, <laughs> and people that you have to take care of, because you never end up sleeping again. You guys had a lot of suggestions about other things to bring to show and tell, and we're going to go ahead and do that right now. We're going to do some of the easy stuff first. Actually, I'm going to bring, I think, $3. Right around $3. $3. We're gonna bring three dollars. We're gonna bring this lunch pass because I can. And we are going to bring this flower because I can. Now some of the things are gonna be really easy for show and tell. We're gonna buy all the stuff that Monty can sell us. And we're just gonna go straight to show and tell and see what a lot of stuff has to offer. You guys said the screwdriver, the voice recorder, and of course the yo-yo. We never did the yo-yo last time. I was like talking about it, and then we never freaking did it. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna take, because I said I was gonna do it and then I totally didn't do it. The key mold. Bam. Would I get in trouble for having a key mold? Why would I get in trouble for having a key mold, right? I mean, what we, oh, someone said bring the phone. We already did that. That was in another episode. I don't remember which one off the top of my head. But we did do it. And the teacher was pissed. Uh, all right, let's go on over here. So here we are. It's morning time, as it often is. Someone also said the severed finger, which I had mentioned before. I do want to bring that severed finger over there. We did the janitor's mop when he blew up. Oh, and someone said that we could punish Monty in horrible ways. We're gonna try and do that as well. Real quick though, crap hola. Real quick though, let's buy some stuff. I wanna buy, oh, and the cigarettes too. You guys wanna do cigarettes. I can't remember if I did the cigarettes. Do the yo-yo, blam, all right. Let's go ahead and do the cigarettes. Actually, let's do the screwdriver because we want to make sure that we get this. Blam. Got a buck 25 left. How much are the cigarettes? Those dollars, well, I feel like they're more than a dollar. Uh, oh, they're still a dollar. Man, you can get anything for a dollar from Monty. I'm going to tell you what. What else do we have left? We have the voice recorder, right? But it costs a little bit more. Yeah, $2.50. Um, can I sell my pass? I don't think I can. Oh, I can. $3. Bam. <laughs> Now we're out of money, of course. Oh, maybe we're not. Can we buy? Can we buy? Oh, no, okay, we can't. I was going to say, if we could buy the voice recorder, I would have done it. All right. Nothing right now. We've got cigarettes. We've got screwdrivers. We, man, we got everything. We're going to be showing everything in here. Someone else also said, call Cindy a whore. <laughs> when I say it like that, it sounds really bad. Like, the context of the game. Anyway. Someone said, call Cindy a whore, but then it, at show and tell, show the flower. I don't know if that'll do anything unusual or what. Go back over here to Monty. We have $3.25. Uh, buy. Oh, you have nothing. You have nothing for me. That's interesting. So the voice recorder, oh, the voice recorder can only be bought in the first period then, can it? Oh, you know what we haven't done yet either? Magnifying glass. Never got the magnifying glass. Um, how do we want to do this? We have a yo-yo, but I don't want to give it to him. We could have done the pills as well. All right, let's just keep what we got for right now. And I don't think that there's anything else that we can get at the moment. So let's go ahead and uh, pump up the volume, so to speak, here. You get all these done. I think that we may be able to get like a salad or something like that from old Monty in here. We can bring that to show and tell as well. 
I want to buy something. What do you got for me? A salad or a McGlob Silly Meal. I think that when we bought the McGlobs and we and we showed it at Show and Tell, that's how we got one of the Monster Mon cards. So salad it is. Mmm, delicious vegan salad. There we go. You're coming to Show and Tell with me, baby. All right. Anything else going on here? Lily's kind of hanging out. Oh, hmm. I wonder. Someone said, yeah, let's try it. Hold on. Maybe this is going to work. I'm not 100% sure here because we used one of our apples. You spelled biscuit wrong. The nerd said that you did it and you know what to do. That's right. Hobble your ass over there. I hope you're ready, Monty. Hey, look up. Look down. Look left. Look right. Because there's a mop coming right to your eye. Uh, uh, uh. The blood is plentiful on this day. This day of kindergarten. The place where mops often come into contact with people's zygomatic arches. Shameful display. <laughs> Give me the glasses. Give me the glasses. Yes. Because that's how we're going to get out of here. All right. Now, go up here and talk to Monty real quick just because I think it's funny. Ugh. Rest now, son. Rest now, you poor bastard. Uh, I want to get out of here and go to the bathroom. I do have a pair of glasses for you, my good lady, with your wrinkly ass face. Plenty of slop to go around, boys, but not for me. I'm out of this bitch. All right, I'll go over here, talk to Lily. Okay, walk away from Lily. Do I have to knock on this and kill her? Like, is that is that how this goes? Uh, do nothing. All right, so we can't actually do anything. So let's go back in here. Now, someone said if you talk. If you talk to the janitor again, he'll beat Monty again. Is that true? Anyway, now that's out. Now that's taken care of. No, I don't want a biscuit ball. Hold on over here. We may have to try something else. Ugh. He flipped. He went from one side of the floor to the other. Damn it. Beat his ass again. Be oh, you can't beat him again. Oh, my God. What? How'd you even know you carry Monty can the dweeb with the glasses? What's going? He's already dead. He's already dead, janitor. Don't do. What do you want, guys? <laughs> Look at his face. <laughs> Look at his face. Poor Monty he doesn't even have his glasses. He looks like he went freaking twelve rounds with Mike Tyson. I got a comment for you. Here it comes. Oh God, no! He healed him. The janitor healed Monty. He didn't kill him. He restored him. He. Oh crap. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I think we glitched out the game. I can't do anything. Is his body, like, every once in a while standing and then flying? It looked like it. It looked like he got back up and then got knocked back. Oh, there he is! <laughs> so Monty's blood got removed. The janitor, all the blood on the janitor is still there, though. All right, okay. We. I can't actually do anything. I have to restart the room. Thanks, guys! You broke the game. That's fine, though. All right. Um, let's go grab the salad again because I do want it. Uh, I need to buy something. Uh, the salad. Very good. Here we go. All right. So now I got the salad. We have plenty of things to bring to show and tell. Yeah, Lily, you, uh, you, you friggin' skirt your power walk your ass out of lunch. Find out what happened to your brother. Um, there's nothing in here, right? It's a garbage can. All right. That's kind of what I thought. Um, and then someone said the recipe for the dog balls. <laughs> someone said eating dog testicles. Yeah, I don't think that they're dog testicles. Well, the dog's testicles may be part of the balls, but I don't think that the entire ball is. The, you, you, you know what I mean. All right, let's get out of here. Boom, 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 boom. Over to recess. We've done plenty of learning. All right, Monty, do you have anything to sell me besides the card? Just that one Monster Mon card. That's the $12.50 card, I do believe. Everything else over here is fine. Shouldn't need anything else. Uh, let's go ahead and pump our way through here. Back to show and tell and let us start doing show and tell. One of you guys had said, keep resetting the room instead of doing the day over and over again. Yeah, you're right. I'm stupid. All right. Let's do McGlop. Where the hell is my cursor? There it is. Let's do the salad. What is that? It's a bunch of leafy greens in a bowl. It's a salad, you cow. <laughs> oh, shit. Whoa. Bugs shots right across the bow. Oh, so that's what a salad looks like. 
My doctor keeps saying I should. What did you just call me? Nothing. Oh, good. Because you're no model yourself. Anyway, hold on. We got to restart the room. That was a... Whoa, what the hell? Yeah, I want to restart my... Okay, good. All right. That was actually freaking amazing. That little spat back and forth was freaking sweet. Um, all right, let's do cigarettes. Drugs in school. How horrible. Give those to me right now. I don't have to pick some. <laughs> now I don't have to pick some up after school. Yep. Oh, I'm also sending you to the principal's office. We have some tolerance policy on violence, but a zero tolerance policy on drugs. We have a some tolerance policy on violence. Of course, of course we do. Why wouldn't we? To the principal's office with me. Well, son of a bitch. I can put up with a lot in this school. Missing children, violence, a janitor with a questionable past. That is a lot for you to put up with. But there's one thing I will not stand for in my school is drugs. They're not drugs, man. Well, I mean, it has nicotine in it. But, I mean, it's a cigarette. I know how to handle delinquents like you. Counseling? Nope. There's the Chrome 357. Drugs are bad. Don't show them to anyone. Drugs are bad, okay? Let's go ahead and restart the room. Okay. I hope everyone had a good recess. Yeah, I have a great recess. I've learned a couple of things. One, showing the salad is hilarious. Two, showing the cigarettes gets you blasted. Let's show the screwdriver. Oh, a screwdriver. That's my favorite drink. Oh, I, we did show this before. I totally remember it now. The janitor was mentioning how he wishes he hadn't sold his to Monty. Apparently, there's a loose shelf in his closet or something. Oh, hold on. We got to restart. Restart. Don't go anywhere now. Um, that was a that was a hell of a hint too. It's like, hey, in case you haven't figured it out, wink, wink. There's something inside of the shelving area. All right, what did we bring? We brought a yo-yo. A yo-yo, dude. I love yo-yos. We could totally hang out if you get me one of those. That's great, Jerome. We all know you wouldn't bother being anyone's friend unless they're cool enough for you, anyway. All right, so that was that. Let's go ahead and restart the room here. We have a couple of things. We do have, okay, now someone said show the flower. I already know what happens, but just for everyone's benefit, I'll go ahead and show it. But real quick, let's show this. We haven't shown this. A key mold? What's the key for? It's not for anything. Don't worry about it. Yeah, you shut your mouth, cow. Yeah, I wasn't that interested. I was just being polite. Sheesh. <laughs> All right, very good. And now the final item is the flower, and this is what happens when you show the flower. A flower? That's pretty boring. What's there even to tell about that? I have a flower just like that. One reserved for my boyfriends. Good for you, Cindy. Good for you. Okay, who's next? It's not gonna be that hard to beat that. Oh, I thought that uh, Bugs was gonna come over here and beat the shit out of us. I guess not. Maybe we have to be her boyfriend. All right. So, we showed a ton of things. The salad is clearly the best. I think the salad was the best out of that. What do you guys think was the best one out of that group? The cigarettes is okay too, but the salad was was probably one of my absolute favorites. All right, so that was a bunch of show and tell. Now let's head into the janitor's off. Well, the janitor's closet. I almost said office. It wasn't really. It's not really an office. It's just a closet full of blood and sadness. Oh, we never showed the bucket of blood for show and tell. I just thought about that. I don't think anyone even said it in the comments. I thought I read all the comments. All right. We gotta grab that too. All right, we're grab. Okay, we're grabbing all kinds. Of Thirty-two times on Monday, man. Thirty-two times. This game. I'm gonna tell you something. A lot of people were asking how much the game is. It's on Steam. It's four ninety-nine. I would say I got my five dollars worth. I I've put way more than five hours into this game. I think. I hope I have. I'm pretty sure I have. You could look at my Steam time. I think. Um, but that's the thing, man. I, I usually do like one hour per dollar spent is a pretty good use of time. Especially since a friggin' movie nowadays is like 15 bucks and you're only watching it for like two hours. All right, let's go grab some more stuff and we'll go grab a couple more piggy bank items because we want to get the voice recorder this time as well. So let's go ahead and bring three bucks as we often do so we don't get the crap kicked out of us by bugs. We will bring, um... I'm gonna bring the flower again just because. And I'm gonna bring this key just because. I don't know why. I like to bring this stuff. And maybe it doesn't do anything. Alright, let's get the hell out of here. Just another day for you and me in paradise. Alright, Monty. Give me the shit. 
that I came here to buy. Uh, I want the voice recorder. $2.50. Ugh, fine. You scumbag. All right, I don't need anything else. Um. Oh, you know what I want to do? I want to grab the pills from Nugget so we can grab a lot of stuff out of the, um... Which we'll call it out of the uh, out of the cubbies. Oh, we can't do both, can we? We're not gonna have enough apples to do everything. So, do I want to go? Let me think about this for a second. Do I want to do Jerome's thing with the laser pointer? Yeah, let's do Jerome's thing with the laser pointer. That's what we'll do. Um, so we're gonna need the yo-yo as well. Uh, but that's fine. For for a second there, I was thinking we won't have enough money, but we will. Because all we have to do is sell this lunch pass for $3. Now we have enough to buy the yo-yo to get on Jerome's good side. And there we go. Now we should be able to get a couple of things from the inside of the uh, janitor's area. I also kind of want to buy the screwdriver because I think we're going to be able to get more things from the janitor's area with the screwdriver. Let's go ahead and buy that as well. I may be doing this wrong, who knows? Gray does what he wants, it's probably like 2 o'clock in the morning by now. And we have one apple left. What do I want to do with my one apple? Can we get pills? Hold on. Go over here, Jerome. I'm Jerome. You're a jerk. Well, how about you freaking deal with it, you hoe? Alright, let's go over here. Uh, Nugget. What happened to Billy? Billy's missing. Oh, I think we're gonna be able to get the pills. I think we're gonna be able to do it. You were just talking about him, you scumbag. I need to know to the principal's office. With no apples left, we get sent to the principal's office. Now that right there, boys, is a good use of school apples. Yes, I've been feeling very sad. Give me my pills and get me the hell out of here. There we go. Pills for days, boys. Pills for days. That's like a that's like a hundred and eighty count in there. They don't they don't skimp over here in kindergarten. Waddle your ass over here. Because it's time to get a pill. Everything is fine. So, Principal didn't happen to give you anything, did he? He gave me some pills. But these are mine. We're going to get a dollar for them. Deal. All right. So, we managed to get that. I don't think, I don't know. I, we're going to see if I have enough stuff to uh, to get everything done. I want to get done here. All right. So, you, you mean this yo-yo? Uh, you can have it if you'll be my buddy. And I will help you out. I'm not going to give you the laser pointer when we're done. I can do that. Why don't you, uh, why don't you go do that distracting thing? There you go, buddy. I've got the hall pass of power, and I'm leaving the welcome sign. Hey there, buddy. Not so fast, little dude. Little dude, here's my hall pass. Now get your giant underbite ass out of my way. Yeah, get up out of here, boy. All right, now the, uh, this is the closet, right? Yes, get into the closet. Yes, stolen stuff box, okay. So this is the stolen stuff box. Screw is loose. Do this right here. Bloop. Now, I think we get, yeah, we can only grab one item. I'm pretty sure because we only have, you see, we only have two apples right now. Uh, let's see, a bunch of junk. Laser pointer. Got it. All right, let's get the hell out of here before we get our ass beat. Hey, man, head back to class. Now, we're not going to give him the laser pointer. Hopefully, I can. Okay, kids, we all heard the lunch bell. Okay, cool. So I don't even get to give it to him here. Awesome. That's exactly what I wanted. You're not getting your laser pointer. Hey, kid, over here. Don't. I, there better be an option to not give it to you. Oh, no. I got it. No, I don't want to give it to you. What? How can I not give it to you? You're a whore. I don't want to give it to you. That's awesome. Oh, wait. We have to get it back. That reminds me. Where do I hide it? In the garbage can. Okay, so now, unfortunately, though, this is going to use a bunch of our apples, I'm pretty sure. Hide the laser. Scummy McBagginkins over here is gonna come in. He's gonna do his thing. We don't have it on us. I'm gonna go ahead and power right through this. Okay, this is an issue. We can't go into the bathroom because I didn't buy the cigarettes. Uh, so we're gonna have to do that again. But we still have a bunch of stuff that we can show at Show and Tell. What I am gonna do though, is I am gonna get Monty taken care of. You spelled biscuit wrong. The reason why is because I think we should be able to go back over into the janitor's closet and get some stuff. We'll find out. We got three apples left right now. He's going to go do his thing where he beats the living hell out of Monty. You're not getting healed today, Monty. The last time it was the mop of healing, but today it's the mop of smiting. Give me his glasses. Well, okay. So here's something new and exciting. This was locked. Totally forgot about that. But we can unlock the door. Look at this. The principal's office unlocked the door. 
What happens if we barge in here? What the? How the heck did you get in here? Don't worry about it. Fine, I won't worry about it. But you might have to worry about this from across the damn room. You son of a... You shouldn't go in there while he's in there. Yeah, I guess not. All right. All right, so what? What the hell? This is interesting. I, I went ahead and bought a, a biscuit ball just because... Monty is calling us over. What's the deal, man? Jero briefed me on your little mission. Did you manage to get the laser from the bathroom? No, I didn't. Oh. Well, geez, kid, what good are you? I need that for collateral before I can help you guys. Good luck saving him on your own. What if I paid you? I don't think you understand. I need the laser pointer because that's the thing that Jerome loves the most, and I can extort the hell out of him with it. Wow. Bugger off, kid. I'm trying to come up with a good reason to impale the little junior principal with my mop. Bugger off. Will do. No, 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 kid. What are you thinking? What do you mean? Hey, what are you doing talking to him? Are you in on this? Empty your pockets. I guess not. Now screw off so I can berate this brat a little bit more. Wait, so you don't have it, which means Monty won't help you, right? Right. I'll be hard pressed to find someone more useless than you. If this old lunatic kills me, I'm going to haunt you until the day I die. Oh, man. I love how there's, like, all the different dialogue options if you miss things or if you don't do things or whatever like that. Do you have anything new to say, Mrs.? Uh, nope, not at all. All right. I'm going to... Is there anything new for him to... For me to buy? Oh, no. He's just... He's just berating me because I don't have the laser. All right. Let's go and do this right here. Now, we have a couple of things to go ahead and show it, show and tell. Uh, let's see over here. Let's start with the voice recorder. A voice recorder... This little thing is Cindy's worst nightmare. Hey, what did I do? Oh, please. Like you haven't accused people of things they didn't do before. Get over yourself. Thank you for showing this. I would hold on to it if you ever talked to her again. <laughs> All right. Very good. Very good. A little bit of a hint right there. I can't remember if I ever showed. Someone said show the pills. I can't remember if I ever did. Whoa, there, a whole bottle. You must have really been up with the principal's business today, huh? Hey, kid, you ever want someone to take those off your hands? I got a pretty penny for you. Hands off, Monty. I called it first. Yes, I did see this one before. Oh, man. Let's go ahead and restart the room one more time. All right, now we have the biscuit ball over here. Let's see what this has to say. What is that? Oh, it's one of the janitor's mystery meatballs. I wouldn't eat that if I were you. Is it vegan? It looks vegan. Oh, we've seen this one too. This is where uh, the principal's head is interposed by Cindy's head. Okay, so let's restart the room here. And now we have the hall pass. I think the hall pass gets us killed. Not 100% sure, but I have a feeling that it would probably get us killed. Hey, that's one of the principal's hall passes. He, was miss he said he was missing one this morning. I can't believe you stole it. Go to the principal and tell him what you did. And by tell him what you did, what you mean is... I'm, you're, I'm signing my own death warrant. So it was you who stole the hall pass. I thought it was my disappointment of a son who did it. Jerome's not that bad. No, I suppose not. But you are. Am I really? Yes. And I will not tolerate a student who steals from me. Consider yourself expelled. That seems harsh. Uh. And by expelled, he means shot in the face. All right. Oh, crap. Let me grab my stacks of cash. We're doing the laser appropriately this time. This time I need a pack of cigarettes. Blam. All right, let's freaking do this. All right. We're doing this. We're getting the laser pointer. We got cigarettes this time as well. Out of the way, Quasi. I've got things to do. Get the hell out of here. I'm gonna go over here to the... I like how he doesn't care. Like, we walk right in, right into the janitor's office, and he's, like, totally fine with it. All right. So now we have to go ahead and unscrew this. Oh, crap. You have to have just the right amount of apples, don't you? We're gonna die, aren't we? Oh, we're gonna die. Crap! What in the- Oh, God! Oh, no! No one's allowed the janitor to glass the goddamn janitor! No! Sorry! Sorry! Ain't gonna cut it! I'm really sorry. Me too. But not really. Oh! Oh, no! Ow! Ow! God, no! Why, God? Why this game? Ah, oh, this game! All right. I've got everything set up appropriately this time. We're- It's, it's happening. The laser pointer is happening on this day. Go pay her off. We got everything we need. There goes Lily. She said she'd let you out. All right. And now let's get the hell out of here. We have the cigarettes now, so everything should be totally fine. Into the bathroom we go. Got three apples left over here. I have cigarettes for you, my good man. There we go. Do what you got to do. You're damn right I will. All right, now over here we've got a bag. All right, get the stupid laser pointer. There we go. 
We've got just enough time. Oh, is there anything else we can do over here? Oh, this guy's still over here. He's over by the piss area. Thanks again for the pack, little man. Now, now get back to glass or whatever. All right. Can I? This toilet is disgusting. All right. I was curious if there was anything I could do with it. Are these two people still in here? Yep, there's the grunting. I'm always curious, man. I always like to check this stuff. Like, where, you know, like, in areas where you wouldn't normally check it. Just to see. Digging through, this, digging through the garbage. All right, let's get the hell out of here. We're pretty much done at this point. Lily's still doing her thing. Go back over here. Uh, yep. Let's go ahead and get over here to recess. And we are good to go. Now, we have the laser pointer. So, I don't have to give it up at all. In fact, I'm not going to give it up. I'm just going to spend all of my points right now and go straight to show and tell with it. Blah, 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 blah. Screw you, Jerome. The laser pointer belongs to me. I hope you had a good recess. Why don't you show what you brought? I'll show what I brought. Laser pointer. Ah, uh, yes. Jerome's silly laser pointer. Such a shame what happened to him. What happened to him? What? You had that all along? Man, that is cold. Get over it, Monty. Who's next? All right. That is cold. No wonder no one likes this lady. Like, every once in a while, I kind of feel like she may have a slight, like, a very slight bit of humanity. But then she goes and says something like that. And the humanity goes straight out the window. All right. Last one. We're gonna go grab the bucket of blood real quick and see what happens. Give me my three dollars, damn it. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna take the whole pack. The lunch pass is good because it's like a guaranteed three dollars every time. Let's go ahead and bring this over here. This is, isn't this like a really weird kid's room? Like, look at the size of this room. If you consider this, you know, this bed is probably about, you know, anywhere between like six and seven foot long, maybe. Well, it's a kindergartner, so maybe five to seven feet long. Like this room. This room is like a, a 40 foot long room. This is insane. What kind of kid gets a room like this? Freaking ridiculous. All right, let's get the hell out of here. Head over here, grab all the pieces that we're gonna need because I want the blood this time and that's really all I want. Go ahead and buy something. I want the yo-yo, one of those. I want the cigarettes, one of those. And I don't need the I don't need the screwdriver this time because we're not going to get the laser pointer. So um, we can, however, sell our lunch pass. Whoop! Right there. Let's go ahead and get rid of that. And I don't need anything else now. Let's go and use an apple. Talk to Nugget. And uh, do we even need the pills? Like, do do we even need this? Let me think about this for a second. Um. We really don't. Actually, don't worry about it. Yeah, we don't need we don't need the pills. I mean, it's it's extra money, but it's not a big deal. Let's just spend our last thing over here. Go inside, right over here. We don't need the screwdriver. We don't need the pills. It's no big deal. Let's go over here to Jerome. Jerome, I got a yo-yo for you, and I need you to let me into the janitor's closet so I can grab something that is completely not your laser pointer. All right. Now remember, we got the bucket of blood over there. What's over here? Monster Mon card. Oh, the note. Oh, isn't this the recipe? We're gonna have to do that next time. All right, don't take anything. I am gonna take the bucket of blood right now. Actually, can we grab two things? Take the bucket. Can we grab two things? I'm gonna try. Hold on. Can I? Oh, oh, hold on. Take the note. Oh, God. Oh, God. Gotta get out of here. Gotta get out of here. Go, 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 go. Run, 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 run. Run, little man. Yes, we got both. We're gonna get both. Freaking sweet. Okay. We got the note and we got the bucket of blood. Both those things are coming to show and tell, baby. Okay, kids, you heard the lunch bell. Let's go down to the cafeteria for a nutritious meal of slop. All right, we are at show and tell. Let's see what happens. I had a great recess, Mrs. Applebottoms. Let's go and show the blood. That is disgusting. Why would you bring that to my classroom? Put it away. I have a mind to send you to the principal for that, but I have this sinking feeling you got that from the janitor's closet. I don't feel like filling out paperwork for this right now, so I'm gonna let it slide. Hee 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 hee. That would look really good on Lily. Oh, it would not. Stop being mean, Cindy. All right, yeah, Cindy, you ho, stop being mean. All right, let's go and do the last thing over here. We have the note right over here. It's a little note. Let's see what it says. Oh, it appears to be a recipe of some sort. Oh dear God, the janitor is eating Cindy's dog. What? That old man is dead meat. 
Cindy, stop! Oh, who am I kidding? Let's just move on to the next kid for show and tell. And there we go, boys! More stuff at show and tell. There's still actually quite a few things for us to show. Remember, we still have to show the severed finger. I think there's some other stuff, too, around here. If you guys can remember anything, feel free to let me know in the comments section below. Other than that, hope you guys are enjoying kindergarten. Till the next time, folks, stay foxy and much love. <laughs>